Hello, this is All Night Guitars again. So I messed up. This is a 1958 Gibson ES335 made in February of uh, 58. This is one of the first of its kind, believe it or not. This guitar is beyond anything you could expect. <laughs> um, it's got an original PAF pickups. It's all original apart from machine heads, but you can have the original machine heads because it comes with them. And that's its original case that it came in. You can only see a bit of it and it's too heavy to lift up. But um, I'll give you a, real, I'll give you a close up of the machine head and the guitar really quick, I'll just show you this. These are original machine heads and uh, as you can see the, the actual like tip on it is actually, it's kind of like gone earwax brown. It's a lovely colour but yeah so you can have the original machine heads and they still work but this is the guitar. It, I'll show you the back because the checking on the back is just amazing. I mean look at that. It's just uh, this is cool, and I wish we had such a thing as smell vision because this guitar smells amazing. And that sounds really weird, but it does smell really nice. I don't know why. But uh, I'll give you a rundown of the sounds quickly. This is the Bridge uh, PAF humbucker. People are laughing at me because they it smells nice. Guitarists know. Okay, so this is the uh, Bridge humbucker. Pickups up. Uh, what can we do with those on? describe the sound of this guitar. Uh, it's just amazing, as well as being an amazing piece of history, just it still does what it's original well it's originally designed to do, which is work nicely. Again, it's all original, so nothing's been changed apart from the machine heads. Um, I was gonna play some stone roses on it. So it's got a really nice slide tone. Uh, just quite, I think he used the Les Paul for this, it's a song called Love Spreads, a uh, really, really cool song, really kind of bluesy slide sound. Let me start again because I got completely cocked up my pleasure. Amazing sound. Um, it's just really cool. Again, that's a good, like slightly broken up overdrive sound. Um, Eric Clapton uses a 335 uh, in Cream. So I'm going to do White Room. Uh, 
kind of full out. Oh yeah, but it's another thing that uh, it's really cool about. Again, Gibsons in, in, in general, it's because they've got, got two tone sir, uh, two volumes and a slight switch between the two. You can actually turn one down so it's cleaner. Clean and have a, uh, another pick up really easy. It's not a middle way around, but I'm going to do it the wrong way. So, yeah, why? It's off the uh, In Rock album, and it's, I don't know if you use a Strat or Fruity 5 on it, but it's got an amazing riff, well it's got amazing loads of riffs, but it sounds like it is. <laughs> ES355, first of its kind, made in February. PF pickups, original case, original machine as if you want, if you want to pull them on. I won't advise it, it'll probably disintegrate in five days. Check finish, tobacco burst, all original. Smells amazing. <laughs> Great guitar, thank you. <laughs> 